Hi, my name is Mo Evelyn, Culinary Coordinator at Shoreline Central Market. Today we're making fresh fruit pavlovas, a super fancy looking dessert that's really easy to make. First we're going to take a third of a cup of sugar and mix it with two tablespoons of cornstarch. The cool thing about this recipe is it can be made sugar free using any of your favorite sugar substitute. You can also make super fine sugar by putting regular sugar in a food processor and pulsing a few times. You want to set this aside and reserve it for later. Next we're going to add our four large egg whites to our mixing bowl. It's about a half a cup of egg whites. Before you get to beating your egg whites, add a quarter of a teaspoon of cream of tartar. All right, so you want to get these going so that they can get light and fluffy before you add the other ingredients. Now add the remaining cornstarch and sugar. And mix some more. Next we're gonna add one teaspoon of distilled white vinegar and one teaspoon of vanilla. These meringues can be flavored any way you like using an extract of your choice. You can use like almond, coconut, any berry flavor, or peppermint. Now we're gonna turn our mixer on high and let it run until the mixture reaches stiff peaks. Okay, so the mixture is done and it's nice and glossy. It forms a nice soft peak and it's ready to get onto your sheet pan. So you wanna take your mixing bowl and then just make mounds however big you want them to be onto your sill pat or you can use parchment if you don't have a sill pat. So just make mounds like that. And you wanna make a little indent in the middle so that it's got a little place for your goodies to go once they're baked. It's easier to do this with two spoons, as you can see, because it just kind of sticks to the spoon. Okay, so this sheet pan is ready to go in the oven. The oven has been preheated to 300 degrees. Our meringues are gonna take about an hour to bake. In the meantime, we're gonna cut four cups of mixed fruit. We're using strawberries and blueberries, and you're gonna mix it with two tablespoons of sugar and two tablespoons of lemon juice, and you can use the zest as well if you'd like. So the meringues have been baking for an hour, and they're ready to come out. And they look great. You wanna let them cool completely, don't touch them. And then when they're totally cool, we're gonna to top them with our fruit. These have been cooling for a while and they're totally cool to the touch. And they're very, very delicate, so you have to be very careful. But we're gonna plate them now. So you just take one, put it on the plate, and you wanna put a little bit of your fruit on, just right in the middle like so. And then you wanna take a little whipped cream And you could just put a little garnish on. A fruit pavlova. Super easy and super fancy. Mm -hmm.